<clears throat> right, this is Shinedown's uh, Fly from the Inside. Strap D tuning. E is tuned down to D. Okay. First is the intro. Play for you first. finger on the A string 9th fret, ring finger on the G string uh, 11th fret. You're going to be muting the uh, D string with your pointer finger. Okay. And I'm going to call it the numbers relative to the pointer finger. So it's 9, sliding up to 10, then sliding up to 12. Then when you come down, you're going to leave your ring finger planted, your pointer finger becomes a bar on the 8th fret, ring finger is still on the G on the 10th fret, for one, for one strong. Then you're going to release the ring, place your middle finger on the G string now on the 9th fret, ring finger moves up now to the D string. 10th fret. Okay, put that together. Okay, second riff. string, but when you play it, you're going to actually use the E, A, and the D strings, and it goes open, 8, 7, and then open, down to 5, to 3, open, then back to three and then five again. Okay, that's the first time. Second time. So far the same. Open twice. Eight seven. faster to get the rhythm. Okay, and you can see I'm adding some um, some muted strums in here. second riff of the intro. Then you have the verse. The verse is played with bar chord on two, ring finger on the G string fourth fret. Okay, it's pretty easy. Second chord is third fret barred, D, A, and D, and then your um, pointer finger it's going to be kind of hammering on, hammering off on the G string second fret. I let it ring throughout that third, that second chord, which the bar again on the first three, hammering and hammering off on the G string second fret. That's the whole verse. Okay, now we go into the bridge. Bar chord on the fifth fret. You're going to put your ring finger on the G string seventh fret. Sliding that now up to the eighth fret. Okay, now that part is 
is the same as the intro. This. Okay, which is bar chord on seven. I'm sorry, on eight. Uh, ring finger on G on the tenth fret. Then off with the ring. Middle finger on the G string ninth fret. And then the third strum is with this formation with the ring finger on the D string, 10th fret. Okay, so. Okay, that's the second time around. First time around is. Fifth fret. Just for, just for the strum. And up to at that point the tenth fret. And then you go back into the intro, which is now the chorus. And then after you hit this, you go down to the third fret, keeping your pointer finger barred. So you're going from this to the third fret. Bar chord on three. Uh, ring finger on G on the fifth fret. Then up to the tenth fret. Back to the intro for the intro riff. Three to ten, and to the second intro riff. Doing that twice. Uh, that's basically the entire song, except for there's a um, breakdown part where he's just basically hammering on and off on. Uh, Three. It hits five every once in a while. Um, that's basically it.